As you know, uh, we, uh, we showed that at Kaplan 20, it's uh, two years ago, in, in IDF 2015. And then, uh, right now, we are represent uh, to Kaplan 20, uh, to Kaplan 30, is uh, a second family of member uh, of two families. And basically, the, the, when you look at these vehicles, uh, the, the main difference is the protection level. Uh, the Kaplan 20 is that there are some limitations in the protections because of the amphibious capabilities, but if the customers want the more protections, Kaplan Church is a good platform to manage this uh, requirement. Uh, basically, the same capacities they have, uh, the total 11 crews they are in the inside. When we look at the inside, we, I can show you more details in the inside and some features and the electronics and situational awareness. Uh, the basic the protection, ballistic protection and mine protection is the, the main uh, characteristics of the Kaplan Church. We are using the different engines in this two, two platforms. So one of them is the 100, 550 horsepower and Kaplan Church is using the 711 horsepower. Two options are available right now. Uh, right now, as you know, this is, the name of the turret is the Teber. The Teber is a 30 mm cannon. And so this version is the unmanned version, and also the manmanned version is available. It uh, completely depends on the customer needed. Uh, the advantage of this uh, unmanned version is uh, inside of the volume. You can put a mini ready round in can, you can install in inside of the turret, and also you can control the vehicle. Commander, gunner, and uh, troops are communicate to each other very fastly and very accurately. The basically. If you look at the systems, the driver stations are very improved. Uh, driver sta station is 30% more space, and also 40% is more field of views available. Uh, this type of vehicles, as you know, the, the, the location of the driver, uh, drivers cannot easily see on the right-hand side because of the engine positions. But in the uh, new hatch systems, uh, uh, give an opportunity to driver, the best driver in, in, in the day and night and also night vision camera is also installed all around the commander and driver can be easily manipulate this camera systems day and night conditions I want to mention about your mobility performance. If you look at the suspension systems, we are using the six road wheel uh, systems and uh, with the torsion bar. Uh, and the, the, the rubber tracks and still uh, standard traditional tracks is also, both of them is available. Uh, the maximum speeds on the road is uh, max, uh, 700 horse, uh, km per hour. And also the vibration will also uh, decrease when you compare with the our standard products. There's a, some improvement in the, the uh, vibration side and the noise level. Uh, on the other hand, uh, the engine uh, compartments, we make uh, some improvement, uh, especially uh, the hard condition area, the hot and uh, cold area, the, uh, we increase the, our cooling capacity, the engine cooling capacity in this vehicle. As you know, we have standard protection level starting from the level four. And Kaplan 20 and NACV is a level 4 protection with the amphibious capability. But if the customers want the more than level 4, I'm talking about level 5 and 6, the Kaplan Church is the right platform. The right platform. So it means that the more than level 4. In these vehicles, we are trying to make it the optimizations on the, on the bodies. Uh, in, especially on the right and left hand side, these are composite armors are using to get this capabilities on the, on the vehicle. And also, if you look at the inside, the spool liner is in everywhere uh, to, to create the, uh, the safe uh, working environment in the inside. Unmanned versions, the protection level is limited with the sum value because of the, we don't need the more protections with the main hull. But the two-man versions, is the uh, protection level is same with the main hull. The basic, the main difference in the 
is the protection level on the unmanned turret and manned turret. Uh, total ammunition capacities in the, in the uh, turret system is 300 in the inside to the red round. Another 300 is in the inside of the platform. Uh, the capacities of the system is about 350 per minute and also Two independent sites we are using. The hunter killer functions is available in the vehicle. We have a different uh, two, two camera systems we are available. One of them is fixed in the, uh, each corner. Uh, the commander and gunner and driver can be selected which, which views they want. Uh, on the other hand, if you look at the Kaplan 20, uh, we say that the see-through armor systems, uh, the commander is wearing uh, some glass. Uh, there is a 360 degree st st uh, stitch view is available in the computer and system is understand which uh, com uh, commander di uh, looking directions and then according to this information giving the right information and right view in, in front of the commander uh, eyes. The laser warning system is also available on the vehicle. Uh, there are 16 grenade launchers attached on the main hull Another eight uh, grenade launcher is attached on the turret. The system is directly work with the laser warning systems.